everyone, it's Katie, how you doing? I turned 20 very, very soon, and while I'm freaking out, I'd love to share 20 life lessons I learned along the way. Some of these might seem a little bit cliche, but they do actually make sense, so if any do speak to you, please let me know in the comments below. Firstly, anxiety, depression. You might have them, but it doesn't mean it should stop you doing anything. I've got anxiety myself and it's really bad, but you know, it shouldn't stop you from making friends, it shouldn't stop you from going out. And I know it's easier said than done, but it's true. You know, just because you have anxiety or depression doesn't mean you shouldn't live your life. Secondly, don't sweat the small stuff. If you're a little stress head like I am, you've probably heard this quite a bit from quite a few people. And it's true, because if you do, stress over something tiny can turn into something massive which just causes more stress which for me will cause a migraine so it will probably cause a headache of some sort in you as well it's just not worth it just relax be chill be chill number three always look for the good in people because sometimes you'll find a best friend and a person that you'd least expect oh, that's amazing that being said you can't always find the good in people and that's okay that's not your fault that's more about them than you you are never ever alone However much you think you are, no, it's not true. There's always going to be someone out there, even if it's just a distant relative you've not spoken to for a while, even if it's just something as simple as your cat or your dog, someone will always be there to listen to you, so never ever think you are alone because you're not. Then again, if you give up hope on people, there's always dogs. Number seven's kind of a personal one because I never used to go out, ever, but embrace the sunny days, embrace the sun, embrace the weather. It is amazing to feel the sun's warmth on your skin. The sun's warmth is also good for you, so go out more often. Don't just stay in, don't ignore everyone. You know, go out, socialise, have a good time. Number eight, singing is amazing, but not every song on the radio needs to be harmonised with. Number nine, sometimes the best songs are the hidden tracks, not the singles. Life lesson number 10 is kind of a human people version of number 9. Sometimes the best people you meet are not the most popular ones, but the little hidden gems that will overshadow people. And that's because like they don't have as much attention, they don't have as much paparazzi around them. So, you know, they're, they're going to be slightly nicer, a bit more private, and you can probably trust them a bit better. Number 11, don't be a sheep, be a goat. So in other words, don't follow the flock, be yourself. Number 12, I can tell you as a singer with anxiety, turning nerves into adrenaline is a great way of dealing with them. Number 13, just because you're 20 doesn't mean you can't love Disney. My favourite Disney princess is Mulan, I just don't regret it at all, I love it and I love Mushu. 14, being kind to people is great, but don't let people mistake that for weakness. You know, be as kind to people as you want, but take no shit. Number 15, this is going to sound really simple, but if you've ever seen the Jeremy Kyle show, you're going to understand this one look after your teeth. You know, you only get one set of adult teeth in your life and if you can't afford to get them replaced, well, you're a bit stuck. Uh, you say just keep them clean, keep them brushed and you know, you'll still look great by the end of it. Plus toothpaste, taste me. 16, I don't know whether this is the most important but it definitely is quite an important one on the list. Look after those who look after you. So, you know, look after your mum definitely or look after whoever your caregiver is or whoever your guardian is because you know they've taken their life and kind of given it to you so the least you can do is care about them in return number 17 it's all right to be a little bit selfish sometimes and people will understand that because if you're not feeling 100 percent how can you be sure that you're all right to take care of someone else number 18 sadly money can't buy happiness but you do need it in the words of that poppy they say the best things are free, but I can't get what I need without some currency. 19. If a kid is already asking you questions about certain things, even if they're kind of a taboo subject, don't just brush it off. Don't tell them too young to understand it. Try and answer them in some way, even if it's a very, very quick answer. Just try and be honest. Try and be like age appropriate, even if it's about like relationships and love and sex. Don't just brush it off. Please just try and listen to them, try and answer them. Number 20, like I said before, don't sweat the small stuff, but also appreciate the little things in life. So even if it's something just as silly as watching trashy TV, like Kardashians or I don't know, Big Brother or something like that, if you like it, you watch it. You know, if you like to do it, you do it. So even if it's something like snuggling up in front of the fire with a good book, under a blanket with another person, do it. You know, if you 
find a nice little love note on your windscreen or if you find like a rose or something through your letterbox, appreciate it, love it. You know, just embrace the little things in life that make you happy. You be you, you do whatever you want that makes you happy, as long as it's not killing anyone. And there you have it, 20 life lessons I've picked up over my 20 long years of life. Um, if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up just to let me know I'm doing my job right. And if you want to subscribe, feel free to do that as well. You can also follow me on Twitter, the details are down below. If you want to leave me a comment, do that as well. I really look forward to seeing your comments. Um, I'll see you next week. Bye!